Hello, Joe here from Infinity of Tacoma, and today I'm going to tell you about this lovely 2017 Infinity QX30 Premium all-wheel drive that we have for sale. We recently took this one in on trade for a brand new Infinity. Uh, some of our nicest pre-owned vehicles come in on trade for new Infinities. This QX30 is no exception. The QX30 was our smallest uh, crossover SUV. Unfortunately, 2019 was the last year it was made from 2017 to 2019. It was made in conjunction with Mercedes is largely based on the Mercedes GLA CLA platform. I think Infiniti and Mercedes had some sort of falling out. That's why production ended, which is too bad because we don't have a vehicle yet to fill the empty model gap that the QX30 has left behind. So if you're looking for a subcompact luxury crossover, this 2017 is a nice one to consider. Um, we took this one in on trade. It's been serviced and checked by our Infinity certified techs. The brakes are good, the tires are good, and all it needs now is a new home. And it's very nicely equipped with features. Uh, we have the premium package, giving you lots of nice standard features on this QX30. Uh, we have this big Panamaric glass roof panel. It doesn't open. Uh, there's really no space for the panel to open because it's a smaller vehicle. The roof is not that big, but um, it does allow not, lots of natural light into the interior, and you do have a power sunshade to dim things down. If it gets too bright. Beautiful uh, Napa leather interior. Beautiful black piano finish. The QX30 employs a dual clutch, a seven speed uh, automatic transmission. Instead of a torque converter like a regular automatic transmission, this uses automated clutches. You have one clutch for the even gears, one clutch for the odd gears, so it can pre select the next gear for very smooth and seamless gear changes. And it's the only Infinity that you can get with a dual clutch transmission because it's from Mercedes. Um, then we have a dual zone auto climate control, uh, we have power and heated front seats. Great sounding Bose audio system. This one also has a navigation package. It has a rear parking camera. Nice uh, leather wrapped steering wheels. You also have steering wheel paddle shifters. We have 38,134 miles at the time of making this video. Really nice color combination. On, I think they call this a magnetic red on a graphite leather. The QX30 is really a stylish little crossover SUV. Very curvaceous, uh, beautiful body. Uh, at the time when it was uh, made, it had some of the most dramatic body contours that you could find on a production automobile. It's a little bit more expensive in the building process to add these really uh, nice stylish creases and curves, but um, this is a luxury automobile and Infiniti wanted to make this look good. And actually, if you do compare it to the Mercedes, the Mercedes uh, styling is a little bit more muted. It's a little bit more conservative, where the QX30 is uh, definitely bolder. And also, apples for apples, you actually get a little bit better uh, for your, your price with the Infiniti versus the Mercedes if you're comparing the two. Um, when they were new, the Infiniti was a little bit lower price point uh, for uh, base compared to a comparable Mercedes-Benz uh, GLA with similar equipment. Maybe Mercedes had an issue with that. Maybe that was part of the falling out. I don't know. And also, uh, with Infiniti, you get a little bit better warranty, too. Uh, and Mercedes just has a four-year, 50,000-mile bumper-to-bumper warranty. Infiniti has a four-year, 60,000-mile bumper-to-bumper warranty. So you get an extra 10,000 miles on the bumper-to-bumper -bumper warranty. But on top of that, Infiniti also has a six-year, 70,000-mile warranty on the powertrain. So it's the engine and transmission. Um, so that's a considerably longer uh, warranty than Mercedes that you have on the engine and transmission. So that's also some other food for thought if you're comparing the two vehicles. And then uh, the only engine available on the QX30 is this 2-liter turbocharged uh, four-cylinder engine. It's sourced from Mercedes. Great engine. It's about 208 horsepower, 250 pound-feet of torque. I've, uh, using a lot of Mercedes products, the C-Class, the GLC, the GLA. I can go on and on about all the different Mercedes products that use variations of that uh, two liter turbocharged engine. The QX30 is available in either front wheel drive or all wheel drive. This is the all wheel drive model. The all wheel drive has more crossover SUV design influences, higher ride height, different wheel and tire uh, package. Where the front wheel drive QX30 is kind of more like a hatchback car type styling. So uh, those are the two basic versions of the QX30. And on our YouTube channel, Infinity of Tacoma One, uh, I do have a comparison of the front wheel drive versus the QX30. Uh, all-wheel drive QX30 if you care to dive a little bit deeper into the differences. Thanks so much for watching this video. Hope to see you soon and have a wonderful day.